FrameMaker 2019, User Interface Improvements. You might not even notice, but in keeping with the modern platform theme for the 2019 release of FrameMaker, we've increased the contrast within the user interface. We've refreshed some of the icons and reintroduced colored icons. Also, in most places you'll find new Windows native dialogs, giving you better search and browsing options. These fit seamlessly into recent versions of the Windows operating system. It may not seem like a big deal, but it adds an extra touch of consistency to the application. Just in case you're not a fan of the new look, you can always choose to use the previous dialog style and even the monochrome toolbar icons in the preferences in the interface panel. For comparison, I've restarted FrameMaker with the monochrome icons, and here is the previous dialog box. There are also improvements in the progress indicators. Now, instead of guessing how much of a process has completed, you get better feedback for things like book processing and PDF creation. You might notice that I'm using the Publish Pod to create my PDF. That's a major change in FrameMaker 2019 and is itself the subject of additional videos. Both updating books and producing PDF are faster thanks to the new 64-bit architecture in FrameMaker 2019, but the additional dialogues are still helpful when performing tasks such as these. We hope you enjoy the new, cleaner look of FrameMaker 2019.